For half a century, NASA has explored the universe, its satellites collecting data and images of our solar system and deep space. The Hubble Space Telescope, Cassini Space Probe, Voyager and Phoenix spacecrafts are just a few of the hundreds of NASA probes that have ignited the public's enthusiasm. Each has played an important role in expanding our knowledge of distant worlds and the outer edges of the universe. NASA curator and scientist David Williams. The very first thing we sent was the Ranger, which was all it was, was it was just, they just shot it straight towards the moon. It started clicking its cameras and it just went in clicking its cameras, boom. It smashed on the surface. Later probes landed on the moon and photographed it from orbit, paving the way for the manned Apollo landings. Still some of the best pictures we have of the moon are, are from these lunar orbiters in the 60s. So these spacecraft characterize the moon so completely that when we actually sent people there, we, we knew what to expect. And I think, you know, that's part of what we're doing for Mars now, too. We're sending all sorts of probes to all different parts of Mars, look at everything we can, you know, see and try to figure out where's, where's the best place to go. A number of probes have mapped, photographed, landed, and even driven on Mars, providing spectacular panoramas of the red planet, evidence of water, and more. The Phoenix lander there now is taking pictures, analyzing the soil and the atmosphere. NASA has, in fact, launched probes to every planet in the solar system, perhaps none more impressive than the Voyager probes launched in 1977. They were built the last five years, but they just keep going. Space historian Richard Launius is with the Smithsonian's National Air and Space Museum. And Voyager is out there. Uh, it's, it's beyond uh, the point at which the solar system has real hold on it any longer from a gravitational perspective. After making observations of Jupiter, Saturn, and their larger moons, the two Voyager probes went on to Uranus and Neptune. NASA project scientist Ed Stone. We discovered world after world, which had just been points of light, and each of them was distinct and different. And as a scientist, it was just an incredible period of discovery. And even today, as we head to interstellar space, we're still discovering things that we had not thought about before. The Voyagers provided details of Saturn's rings and discovered that winds blow up to 2,000 kilometers an hour on Neptune. But finally, it is the Hubble Space Telescope that has captured the public's attention like no other NASA probe. Three, two, one, and liftoff of the Space Shuttle Discovery with the Hubble Space Telescope, our window on the universe. Launched in 1990, the so-called window on the universe has produced hundreds of thousands of spectacular images expanding scientists' knowledge of deep space. Shuttle astronauts will soon return to the space telescope to improve its imaging capabilities, allowing it to continue to probe deep into the mysteries of the universe. Paul Sisko, VOA News.